Hey YouTube, how's everyone doing? Yakfish Taco here. Another beautiful day. Oh, another video. So I'm back here in this place that I was at last week. Just a little bit off east of Mount Hood uh, National Forest. Um, right now I'm at 2400 feet. It's second weekend of May. And, um, and because last weekend I saw some juvenile morales out here, so I'm gonna go back and harvest them, and maybe run into some uh, new batches, you know, new clusters. It's always good to uh, find the new, the new ones, and uh, and hopefully, uh, right now uh, the temperature actually is a little colder than last week. It's about just low, low 40s, but it, we had a pretty good it's kind of warm trend in a week so hopefully things are starting to pop up a lot more and we're finding a lot, a lot more you know closer together rather than kind of sparsely spread out it takes a lot of walking to get the, the number and amount of mushrooms that I need so yeah let's go It's a really nice one, huh? Look at that. That's so pretty. Oh, yeah. Fresh. That's nice. Those are the two big ones. Oh my goodness. This is like insane. And this is like, these are the real blonde ones. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Wow, look at my hand. This is bigger than the one I had yesterday. And they are like fully matured and they are, oh my God. That's my first spot. Oh yeah, two, the two of them right here. Oh yeah. Oh, this is a good, good spot right here. One and two. Yay. Cool. One? Yeah. Nice. Oh, nice. These are really fresh ones. Oh, Two? Cool. These are blonde ones, yep. Blonde and gray. <laughs> Mother load. Oh, yep. Oh, where are the other Yeah, well, that one. Yep, that one. Yeah, I mean, there are two of them together. Maybe. Ooh, we'll... look at the. Oh, my God, this one just. In yeah. the soil. Oh wow. <gasps> wow, this is a big one. Mm -hmm. It's just trying to come out. <gasps> yep. Big wow. One. Gigantic too. I yeah, know. Not sure how where's the stem. It's an alien. Like it's a xenomorph. Yeah, oh, yeah. just right there. The xenomorph. <gasps> it is a xenomorph. Look at that. The xenomorph of morale right here. Okay. That is all around here, yeah? Yeah, we'll take them. We, we don't want to leave anyone by himself, right? And then one here. <gasps> right there. Oh, and then there's one. Oh, there's one right there. <laughs> they just, just magically like, shows up. I know. Yep. They, I mean, I, we couldn't see them. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, it's just like, oh, hello. Hello, yeah. Stranger. Whoa. Wow. Look at that. That's big. Whoa, blondie. So in just this one area, I got like almost a dozen. I think I got more than a dozen uh, morale just in here. And it's like a lot more than what I got for like two, hour, two hours 
uh, last week. Yeah, so they are like maturing for sure. So let's step back and look at this area that we found about almost a dozen, like 11 or 12 uh, morales just right here. And it looks like this, like a lot of like long pine needles, but the soil is not like totally thickly covered. And it, they do definitely do have kind of a, a good, like a thin distance into the soil. So it's like some places are really thick with this kind of pine needle and uh, seems like it's not having a lot uh, morales than the areas like this. Kind of like mochi, but also has a good, good amount of exposed topsoil, black topsoil. And it seems like that. So you know how in my last video, I talked about morale has this kind of mysterious, uh, ghostly appearance to it. Uh, you know, it will show up in front of you like when you least expect it, such as like going to a bathroom break, which I was just doing that. And all of a sudden, I just spotted one <laughs> right in front of me. So maybe my suggestion to you guys is to bring a lot of water, keep yourself really well hydrated, and go pee a lot. <laughs> So they might just pop up right in front of your eyes as long as you don't pee on them. So <laughs> let me show you guys. So that's the one that I saw when I was uh, going on a bathroom break. And then I turn around, got another one right here. So they're small, but there should be more around here. And this is definitely a good area uh, to come back to. So from my past experience, when there are like this type of fake morales around there are going to be the real ones somewhere nearby so sure enough there's a tiny little baby right there, right there. yep so if, when there's a baby they might be the little bro bigger brothers or older sisters around so we have to kind of look around see if there's more around here well sure enough that's the fake one and there's another real one just hiding right in this little hole right here so there might be more too so me had to get myself really down low to scout the entire to scan the entire area they might be even like under some of these uh, so, oh, there's actually two of them in here. Oh yeah, there's two. There's one tiny baby, and then the one the little older one. So that's cool. You got a bunch of little tiny babies here too. Like just one, two, and three. So I think this area still has a little more time to go. Maybe one more week for everything to come up. Yeah, so this, this year seems to be like things a little slower, like one week behind a normal, normal schedule. And uh, it, normally this time of year, this elevations, it's a lot around, but um, it's just not, you know, happening. You know, we got a little bit more than a dozen, but uh, now it's a lot of smaller ones that we're not going to keep. So we'll let them grow a little bit more. So we'll keep looking. Oh. So, they're oh, so they're here. I'm seeing two already. Got one. It's a pretty good size. And then there's one right there. Yeah. It's awesome. So there might be more hiding around. So got to scan again. Oh, so this area seems to be the woods a little thicker and they seem to like to hide under this type of young trees. Yeah, they like shades in here. The blonde ones are like more like out in open. This kind of gray, darker ones, they are a little more shade.
shady. They're the, the shady mushrooms. These guys are sneaky too. Two more nice ones in the bag. Not bad, fresh. Oh, that is a big blonde one. That's pretty. Oh yeah. The gray and uh, darker ones are small, but blonde ones are big. So I think my luck's still, still okay. Still running into some bigger ones. Oh yeah. Things nature. <laughs> Oops. Oh. Pretty. It's not as pretty as the uh, xenomorph, but still pretty. Oh, two more. Yep. Oh, this one's a little rotten on the uh, but uh, the main crown is very good. Yep. Yeah, not bad. So kind of like a uh, Siamese twins. They're conjoined. Sun comes out and there's a lot of mushrooms around, so that's why I stopped here and lucky I did. Oh my goodness. These two are like the perfect twins. Look at them. Wow. The twins. Oh, there's actually one more down there, the little brother. Oh, wow, four. Hey, Veronica, there's four of them in here. Sun came out and then I start seeing mushrooms again. Uh, this little four of them. Nice little cluster. Four in one spot. Mm -hmm. What else can you ask for, right? Well, there's some babies, but they're all attached to each other. It's hard to cut the big ones without cutting the small ones too. Oh well, more will grow, so. Well, there's one just standing right there, staring at me, and it's huge. And it's pretty. Look at that. Oh my goodness. That is a nice one. So pretty. And then, boom. One, two, three. There's like small one that somehow they all mm -hmm. fell off. And then there's one right here. And then one right here. And yeah. And they're all stuck right, right there. There's one. There's one tiny one right here. Oh yeah, oh! One right here, and boom, right there. Anybody else? Hello! <laughs> Anybody else out there? Oh man. Excuse-moi. Excuse-moi. Monsieur, madame. Monsieur, madame. Bonjour. Bonjour, please come out. Merci beaucoup, monsieur. S'il vous plaît. Merci. Oh. Pretty. C'est bon, c'est bon. Oh, yeah. What happened? Look. Oh Did my god, this is what I call the the, the mother low, right? The wow. Right here saying hello. So don't step on me. Wow. Here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Big ones. This is the honey hole right here. Wow. You know like this is where me and Dan was here and we walk. We would just walk up this slope and then we didn't see it. Oh, maybe like that's because it was last time, you know, and... Oh, oh really? How does seven? One, two, three, oh, three, four, huh? five, six, seven. And a bunch of deer poops. Yep. Maybe that's the symbiotic uh, relationship <laughs> next, next to all the poops. All right. So let's get the cutting going. It's not going to be as uh, precise as cutting diamonds, but... We'll, we'll make it work. Make sure we get the prettiest. Oh yeah, I think I can get all of them at one cut. 
One cut. Four of them. Whoa. Yeah. It's like a what? Quadruplets? Yeah. Now this one. Oh. Oh. Not adding one at a time. That's the little one. Second one. Oh, this third one is also a sort of a xenomorph type. Okay. Wow. All seven. All seven from these two holes. Wow. Yep. And who found it? <laughs> Me. Wow. The that mother. was a good load it's right there. The mama find the mama load. Yep. The mother load. The mom find the mother load. Lucky, lucky. Yep. Great day. So uh, we got about a few dozen this time, so a lot more than last time. Some good sized ones too, and then some good clusters, so they are really showing up now. Alright guys, so this is the sort of the transition zone. So see this type of trees, it's very different from where we're finding all the mushrooms down in this valley where mostly are pine trees with or trees with long pine needles um, so so this is seems like this creek bed is sort of like a divider for these two transition zones and out here it's all like dried a lot more open a lot more sunshine and i have never seen any morales out here everything's all in here on both sides of the creek bed near it so yeah if you're just looking for uh you know terrains and uh grounds that uh, has morales maybe look into this type of areas all right so i'm leaving we're crossing the divine getting into the no morale zone leaving the uh, the valley behind uh, it's getting a little dark and we'll definitely come back every year or maybe next weekend maybe or well I got a couple spots up on about 4,000 feet uh, towards the later part of May so yeah make sure you guys uh, subscribe and uh, follow along and now uh, I'll take you guys to my next adventures whenever I can all right peace out thank you